Welcome back to service, everybody. What do you guys think of the new setup? I know it's mostly like gaming stuff right now. We'll get some cool climbing stuff. Uh, just a lot of climbing decorations and knickknacks. They just kind of look like <laughs> flea market garbage. So uh, I'll see if I can find some that are actually kind of cool and exciting looking. So last week you guys sent me this clip of this cat that's like pretty good at dinoing and the almighty YouTube algorithm has been spamming me with videos of this cat. And it is awesome. You guys didn't even send me the best clip. Yes, it's this one. All right, so <laughs> this video is amazing. So this video, popped up of this cat. <laughs> it's like this little kitten. I was like, what is this? And it's the same cat that you guys sent me. Jump. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's the best part. I don't know how that hasn't been memed yet. I thought he missed his chance. The bird just takes off and he jumps like 40 feet in the air and then they can't find him <laughs> and they zoom in. <laughs> so the cat can dino, cat can definitely dino. But that's enough about cats. We're gonna get in today's video, uh, which we got, we got a lot of dinos to get through. All right, so my wife showed me this one uh, earlier. Th this is at my gym and not only that, this is my dino. I've been working on a video for like a month now of all these cool dinos. This was one of my dinos. You thief, you snake, you stole my dino and put it in and now everyone see, look, I just did this dino and then you come in here, post it in my subreddit. What is this? And he did a little extra. He did more than I did on my own dino. This is unacceptable. You can't be affecting the outcome of my own videos. I wonder if I was like in the gym when you were trying this. I, I feel like I would have seen you because I would have said something, but yeah, if you ever see me in the gym, feel free to say hi. I don't give a shit. V4 Dino with a karate kick. Oh my goodness. I'm more excited about the karate kick than I am the Dino at this point. What's he gonna kick? You should have had somebody getting kicked in the face with the karate kick. You can't say karate kick and then not kick somebody. Here, I'll show you what it should have looked like. I bet that segment came out really well. I'm sure that was super cool. The setters are listening to the church with this massive paddle dino V8 Plus, wow, by Jaron Climes. Let me guess, it's gonna be uh, an almost impossible dino that he flashes. All right, Jaron, show us what you got. Jaron always does the, the hardest dinos in here. What? <laughs> Every time. <laughs> I thought he was just dinoing up to the sloper. I was like, oh, okay, it'll be kind of cool. Usually it's, it's some, I expect a little more out of Jaron, but of course it's something fucking wild. Having a little trouble matching the top though. Oh, there he goes. Very nice, Jaron. Went to a new gym. Sad this VAV9 wooden stick by Muted Struggle. Some of you guys got some wild names. Muted Struggle. That sounds like a, a band, like an emo band. If you don't have a band, you get, now you got a name. Pretty good name. Let's see a V8, V9 dino. That's on the higher end. We don't get a lot of V8s and up in the, 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 the Church of Dinoology. I'm excited to see uh, what we got. Holy, oh my God. <laughs> That was, that was awesome. I don't mean to laugh at your failure, <laughs> but it was funny. <laughs> Look at that. That's crazy. <laughs> That's a great fault too. That's all around just a great clip. Favorite one of the videos so far. First ever dino didn't top boulder because I'm a fraud. Well, at least you're honest. I don't, I don't care about the, the, the boulder. I just care about the dino. As long as the dino is good, uh, you won't be a fraud. I love the rental shoes. Rental shoe dinos are the best. Very nice. Good job. Don't worry about not topping. And who tops boulders nowadays anyway? Nobody. It's uh, Topping boulders is out of style. Dinos are where it's at. Dinos and rental shoes are really, really where it's at. Good job. Dino, dino, Halloween 2020. Did somebody actually do the dino in the, did, did you reply for the, <laughs> did you post this after I asked? No, it's Halloween 2020. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Somebody else posted them in the gym with the dino suit on, but they didn't do a dino. I said somebody should do a dino and that <laughs> looks so cool. Did you stick it? It looked like he didn't even get his arm up. It is really hard to tell what's going on with this thing. I gotta watch it one more time. It is very distracting. <laughs> it looks so cool. Hell yeah. Let's go. <laughs> the dino dino. The only thing we can do now to one up this is if somebody does a dino in a Barney costume. Nice dino set at my local gym, Ar Algarve, Portugal. A kid ran in front of the camera, but he was too fast. <laughs> you can't even see him. Let's see what kind of dinos they set in Portugal. I've never seen a, a Portuguese dino before. It could be pretty crazy. Maybe it's upside down. Well, that would be the Aussie dino. 
That was a pretty sick dino. They, they got dinos figured out in Portugal. Where's the kid run by? I guess I won't see him. Oh, there, there he is. He, he's lightning fast. He's the fastest kid in the world. Been climbing about a year. My dad set this one. Big up. Big ups to the dad for being a saint to the church and setting dinos. Oh, this one's full screen. Pretty crazy. That's a big run up. Damn, your dad set that? And that was your first dino? <laughs> Did you say that was your first dino? No, you've been climbing about a year. That's what you said. I'm also curious if your dad's a setter, why have you only been climbing for a year? <laughs> Seems kind of random, but uh, congratulations. Very cool dino. I think it's forced. All right. So this is a forced dino. Is that what you're saying? Or you think you're forcing the dino? I don't quite uh, understand. <laughs> what? Wait a minute. Wait. <laughs> I thought that was going to be like, it has a lot of upvotes. So I guess I knew it was going to be kind of cool. That's stop. That's insane. I, I've been working on a video for weeks now, building up some of the coolest dinos I can do. And I was going to do a 360 dino in it for you guys. And I had one that I thought was pretty cool. This is way cooler. You guys need to slow down a little bit. You can't be one upping me in my own subreddit. You're affecting the outcome of potential videos at this point. That is absolutely insane. I thought he was just going to do like a huge step up dino or something or like a slide. I thought it was gonna be a fail or something. That is insane. It was 360 the, the opposite direction. All right, you win this one, subreddit. You guys win this one, uh, but you just wait. Now I have to do an even cooler 360 dino. That means uh, I get to scrap all the footage of my cool 360 dino that I did that I thought was so epic. What step up? So you're supposed to go kick off of this right here and then go up to that, but instead he just jumped, jumped straight up. I don't even know if that makes it much easier, but uh, Still cool to skip the first move. All the short people watching, does this does this bother you at all? Does this upset you? <laughs> See this man just jump straight up the wall. Short people are so mad right now. Short people are fuming. Devious side dino to a bad hold. This one's gonna be devious, so be ready for some, some deviousness. <laughs> does the camera work? <laughs> There's some some high level Hollywood level filming there. I couldn't even tell what the dino was because there was so much going on. It reminds me of a. Uh, have you ever seen the raid? The movie with the dudes like, and he's like, it's a, the 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 uh, Indonesian film with uh, Iko Uwais, and yeah, he like fights all the time. They have all these crazy camera things like that where it's like wobbling. You should apply for the raid three. I'm sure they're working on it. Dino. That was a dino. Me only no dino. The run up dino, <laughs> the rest of the climb. This is uh, unfortunately very accurate. The run up dino leading to the actual boulder problem feels like a V0. The boulder problem that's graded V3 feels like V7. Cool campus board like climb. I, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know what that means. I guess uh, is, is it a campus problem, is that what you're saying? Let's see the cool, Oh, that was a big, big move. All right. You're going to keep campusing. Looks like you lost a bit of your momentum. All right. Man's doing a one five nines on the bouldering wall. My mate showing off how strong his shoulder joint is. He's got big shoulders. This is, this is a big dude. Yeah, <laughs> I would imagine a dude that looks like that would uh, would be fine doing stuff like that. Most climbers don't look like that. Most climbers uh, look like me. Right. So, you know, that is wild though. I don't know how he didn't just destroy his rotator cuff. He does another one right after that. Downward dino. Follows it with the downward dino. Absolute legend. Paddle dino. All right. All right, I already see what he's supposed to be going to. I do not see any feasible way to, <laughs> to get between these. Does he have to jump from that position? All right, I got I got a couple a <laughs> couple things about this one. First of all, why? Why would you set that? That looks miserable. I love a good dino. That's that's past being fun at that point. That looks miserable. Those are both slopers. And then uh, the other thing, I don't know if I would count that as a finish. <laughs> it looks like you spun off the finish there. I don't know if you meant to count it, but you got to be in control of the final hold. He just kind of spins right off. I'm sure that's why you uh, submitted it here so that you could uh, have me judge whether or not it counted. We're also introducing a new segment to the Church of Dinoology videos called Guess the Grade. This segment's a little complicated, so try to keep up. Um, what we do is 
I try to guess the grade of the dyno you did. And then you guys can go in the comments, let me know if I was right or not. Pretty cool new segment, definitely not just so I can get more dinos in the video. All right, so this one, he's starting off on a big jug. It looks like he's going to another big jug. Pretty big dyno though. Um, it's hard to say, those are jugs. The next holds are also really good. It looks like, I would normally say probably like V2, but because of the dyno, I'll give you V4. All right, this one looks pretty tough. This one's gonna be hard to grade. I'm gonna have to see the dyno. <sighs> that's definitely not an easy one. I'm gonna say because of the holds in the dyno, I gotta see him finish it. We're grading the whole boulder, not just the dyno. He didn't even finish it. How am I supposed to guess the grade if you didn't finish the boulder? But based on the boulder and the dyno, I'm gonna say that one looks like it's probably around V6. Oh, he literally sends it right, right, right after. It's literally the next post. All right, let's see him stick the top. Out of respect for Sasquatch. Very nice, I'll give you V6. All right, this one is set by Sick Mouse, you know, so he set this himself, so you'll definitely know the grade. And you know, you show Sick Mouse a little bit of respect, he's probably set more dinos for the Church of Dinoology than any of you. So we got the big drop knee. Uh, it looks pretty chill so far, it looks a little tough. Nothing crazy, still don't see a dino. I'm guessing he dinos up to that little uh, diamond up there, a little triangle. All right, let's see it, Sick Mouse. What kind of dino did you set for us today? Very cool, I'm gonna say, probably in the V5 range. <laughs> a lot of these are gonna be V5, uh, it's a pretty safe bet. All right, this one, the holds look a little rough. They don't look the best, but they also don't look terrible. It's on slab, so we have to keep that in mind. Pretty tough looking dyno, uh, pretty tough looking finish. I'm gonna say, this is a hard one, V5. <laughs> this is a whole series of guess the grade. They're all V5. That was the trick the whole time. I don't know. I'm going to say, normally I would say maybe a little bit harder. It might even be easier than V5 because it's on slab. I don't know. Let me know if I'm right or not. All right, we're starting on a big volume, big jug. Got a lot of jugs, it looks like. Catching two jugs, but still pretty big dino. What else do we have? Campusing. Those are some crazy pants you have on also, by the way. Very breathable, I'm sure. They look, uh, I missed that part. They look like it was more campusing. This one I'm gonna be a little bit more conservative with. I'm gonna say this one, uh, cause you know, there was a dyno at the start. You didn't have to do the rest of it campusing. I'm gonna say probably V4. This one looks like it'd probably be around V4. All right, this one is in Fontainebleau. That was pretty big, pretty big dyno. It looked like the hold you're going off of is decent and the tap is decent, but it is Fontainebleau. And this is a hard guess to grade, because this one's set in stone. This one is gonna have a grade that is solidified. I'm gonna say, because I know Fontainebleau so well, I'm gonna say V7. That looks like it's about a V7. All right, let's see Barney, the big purple dino. I can already tell what he has to do. It looks awful. <laughs> do you have to go two hands? Okay, so you paddle into it a little bit. I can't tell how good that hold is. It still looks uh, really difficult. I have to guess the grade of the whole thing though, not just the dyno. I hate these holds. I absolutely hate these ones. The, the, the fake jugs, they're actually slopers on the inside. It's stupid. I'm gonna go with, uh, I'm gonna go with V7. That one looks like a solid V7. All right, I don't see any holds for this one. Oh, he's going to the volume. Okay, that looked really hard. I gotta, I gotta, uh, let's backtrack a little bit. Let's see that one more time. I gotta see the dyno. That's insane. This might be the hardest one we, we've had to guess the grade of yet. That That is wild. All right, I didn't even see a foothold there, but he's standing on something. Good Lord. His name his name is V10 Boulder. Not V10 Boulder, or just V10 Boulder. Well, I'm gonna guess that the grade of this then is uh, V10. All right, I gotta break this next one down. This one's gonna be this week's video breakdown segment because this one is on a sport climb. So this guy is gonna dyno his way up in the fewest possible moves. We're gonna keep count, that's one dyno. I'm very intrigued right now because uh, <laughs> I've yet to see anything like this. Two dinos, he's doing the fewest possible moves and he has to clip along the way. I don't know if clipping counts as a move, but we're just gonna count the dinos. Three dinos, he's already halfway up with three dinos or like uh, close to halfway. If he dinos all the way up to that big one, that, that, that'd be a big uh, time skip there. <laughs> using speedrun terminology. Hell yeah, four dinos. I'm guessing, my guess is uh, seven. If he can get it in seven, I'll be very proud, very excited. I see why this one got so many upvotes. This is very exciting to watch, weirdly. All right, dino number five. 
damn, he's, he's doing big ones. He might surpass my expectation. What if he gets it in six? He could potentially get it in six. I think he went up a hold. I might be wrong. I don't, I don't know. Hell yeah, six dinos. He did an entire sport climb in six moves with a big whipper to finish it all off. Congratulations, uh, that's probably uh, that's probably the most unique thing I've seen on here in a long time. I think he did do a little bit of static climbing here though. He did. There was actually seven moves, I was right. See, he goes up to the next hold. A little bit of static climbing thrown in there. I get it though, you don't, you don't want your buddies to judge you. you. Probably hang out with a lot of sport climbers. Biggest running dino I've ever done. Let's see the biggest running dino this guy's ever done. It's not playing. We get one that's finally in full screen and it won't play it. Reddit do be like that sometimes. <laughs> All right, this should this should be fixed now. Biggest running dino he's ever done. He didn't do it, <laughs> that was a good fall though, okay. Multiple attempts, I like it. That's a big jump. Of course now, the, the bad quality one is the one where he gets it. We get it in the worst quality and it's in slow-mo. Thank you. That was a good, at least that was good timing on the slow-mo. I didn't mean to, to criticize you so early. You did the slow-mo the way you're supposed to do. You do it right at the, the right part. Some people have the whole thing in slow-mo. Very cool, very difficult looking step up and everything. I know this isn't guess the grade, but I'm gonna guess probably around V8. That'd be my guess. Holy shit. He jumped so high at the end. <laughs> I barely caught that. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. An actual intended dino, very rare. That's actually not wrong. Let's see what kind of dinos get set when route setters actually set dinos. Oh, except for Sick Mouse. Sick Mouse is always setting dinos. Sorry, didn't mean to call out all route setters. <laughs> Very cool. So this one's a whole breakdown of this, this dino process. I gotta, gotta really take this seriously. Watch me try a slab dino. All right, I will watch. <laughs> The unironic, uh, excited face meme. I like the uh, the edits. The edits are fun. I'm pretty sure I planned on using that exact same sound effect in this video, so I guess I'll have to cut that now. Wow. Oh man, this music's getting me hyped too. You guys, you guys don't get to get to hear it. You're really missing out. Oh, she got it. I, I missed it again. She got the dino and the music. Hmm, man, I you, you know it'll get copyrighted if I play it, but you guys, you're really missing out right now. Does she match it? Nice. Very cool. Good edits. That was fun. I like the, the extra enthusiasm put into the post. Outdoor coordination dino? There's no way. <laughs> there's, there's no outdoor... <laughs> what? <laughs> he did it. <laughs> they do exist. <laughs> the outdoor coordination dino. I thought it was going to be like a meme. That's like a legit outdoor coordination dino. That's crazy. Is that an actual like set thing or did you just make that up? I like to think that you made that up. I like to think that we're the most creative, you know, us here at the church. Good job. That's awesome. Huge downward dino. First post in the church. Why, why, why'd you start with the downward dino? I mean, do whatever you want, I guess. I have no idea where he's going to. Is he going all the way over to the other blues? Holy shit. Look, look at how far he goes. Why do you do that to yourself? Is that set that way? I thought those were like illegal. I thought it was against the law to set downward dinos. That's crazy. Very cool. I like the uh, climbing in swim trunks. Cool look. Zesty dino. My hands are bleeding from 100 attempts with no completion. Where the fuck do I go once I've dinoed? There's no right foothold or anything to get any leverage. All right, we're gonna have to do another new segment. There's two new segments in this video called Beta Breakdown. All right, this man has asked us for help with beta and we're gonna give it to him, starting with uh, what looks like the dino. Let's see how it goes. 100 attempts, his hands are bleeding. So he's got the dino figured out, but he doesn't know where the fuck to go afterward. All right, looks like you got it figured out. Go up to the pinch, get your feet up to the right. All right, well, there's your problem. You need to get your feet up, my man. You gotta go left hand here, right hand here, foot up to that foothold, fall into it, crossover. I hope that helps. Uh, that's the beta I've got. Going to church in my garage. I want a home gym so bad. A, it would make making videos 
a lot easier because I could film in the garage. And also it would just be cool, make training easier, set whatever I want, set dinos all over the place. You're, you're very lucky to have a worship center in your home. Let's see what a home garage dino looks like. Very cool. You know, they say, <laughs> they say that uh, dinoing in your house is useful for warding off evil spirits. So, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talk talking about at this point. <laughs> Burden of D's V18 first ascent. This is uh, this is wild. First V18 Burden of D's. This looks like a wall that's really really dinoable. Looks like it was designed to be dinoed on. Why we never had anything like this in the parks when I was a kid. We never had any climbing walls. Is he gearing up? Oh, he just he didn't even do a dino. He made it look like you tease. <laughs> it's like frustrating to watch. He keeps like building up like he's about to do a dino and then he doesn't dino at all. V18, my ass. This is V9 in my gym at best. V47 in my gym. V19 to the 273rd power in my gym. Amazing climb. I can only imagine how many attempts this took. I love how this post, <laughs> this, this, gets, this is the second most like upvoted post of all time in the subreddit. And he gets like flooded with comments. Well, those are all of our dinos for today. Uh, make sure I'm going to be on vacation next week. So uh, uh, it might be a little bit hard. We'll see if I can get to the, the, the church, if I can access the church. I'm gonna be out in the middle of like bumfuck nowhere, so I might not have Wi-Fi, but I will still do my best to review your guys' dinos. And uh, yeah, we got a lot of cool videos coming out. So I'm, I'm really excited about that. Hopefully you guys are too. Thank you for submitting your dinos and I'll see you guys next week in two weeks. <laughs>